Hi guys. I'm bored. I've been doing a whole week of videos on YouTube. Like Monday was my first video and it came out Wednesday. Then I did Tuesday a video that's coming up the week after. And then today it's Wednesday and my first video is up. And now I already am bored. What's wrong with me? Hey. <laughs> Come on, touch screen. Yes. Yes, it works. So, guys, what have I been doing the last few days that I am doing my videos? Well, I actually am like checking my mail from my other job. They still need to give me some information that I actually need, but I have to contact someone else and it's confusing and not at the same time. It's like I don't want to make contact with my other job. <laughs> so what I'm actually doing is, for example, because I'm doing nothing, I'm actually like trying to decorate my room. Like I said in my other videos, I still have to buy a office chair for my desk. I'm gonna buy that one in Ikea. It's like a black leather chair. Yes, and like there, so there is my office and then like like the other room where my little closet is. I'm going to put like two chairs, it's like my chill area and I will like put maybe a television, I don't know, maybe a television, my Xbox, my Playstation, yeah. Yeah, I am like doing little things. Last night I just had a little spa with my mom and my mom actually enjoys those little mom and daughter time. And my mom did it with me and I had a allergic reaction on one of my masks. I was here around my cheeks and my forehead. I was red. I, it was and I had a really burning sensation. I was like I did it last week. How am I allergic? How? What's wrong? Eventually in like five Maybe ten minutes. I don't know. It was gone. So I'm actually happy because or else you would see like Red face red face me <laughs> on my Instagram. I said I was like two to three weeks in my house and a lot of people said yeah just do youtube videos do um look like series and and films and someone said just go walk i'm like i am not allowed to go out so how can i go for a walk if i'm not allowed i can walk in the house but yeah um, i'm still doing the fitness thing i am actually gaining weight my weight was i think i gained like a, a kilo or half a, at least half a kilo well a friend of mine said like look series and all those things if i have to be honest i was watching the witcher sabrina and that's it i haven't seen movies i even didn't watch the flash supergirl legends of tomorrow batwoman i haven't seen the new episodes like the last I think one month and a half. The last time I saw an episode of The Flash was mid-February. Begin February? Wow, that's a long time ago. Oopsie. Well, I think I will see some series then. Yep. Well, whatever. But yeah, I was thinking maybe new movies that came out. Like I Am Mother, Fantasy Island, Maleficent, Mistress of Evil. Terminator, Dark Fate, Bombshell, Transcendence, Charlie's Angels. Okay, it's like I have a few options. Maybe the Joker again because I actually like that movie as well. Hmm, maybe. Or maybe on my phone, I don't know. 
my god, people are interrupting my video. Since the C word came in like in the first week, a lot of boys are irritating me, like sending me texts like what are you doing? What are you doing? And then other one, what are you doing? And what are you up to? And then I'm like, boy. Didn't you see my Instagram post? I am not allowed to go outside because of my health And then I always say like, yeah, I'm not doing anything except staying inside and survive And then they're like, oh yeah, I'm sorry, I forgot And then not even an hour later, says it again Then I'm like You are not even in your 30s And it's like you already have young dementia or like alzheimer or something with losing your memories your short-term memories but yeah and then one guy i actually am quite cringy about he is like sending me inappropriate texts and i'm like boy that's really unrespectful just be an adult and don't talk to a lady a young woman like this because this will not get you the attention you are going to get because I was straightforward to him I said like look these unrespectful texts are not going to get you the love you need and going to give you the love you uh, deserve because the things he sent me I'm like what the actual have some respect I don't know how your parents have taught you to talk to women but this is not the way to talk to women especially in these times and then I said like I said like look this is my honesty this is my opinion it's a bit weird what you're sending me and I don't appreciate it and I said like he, and he said this to me like yeah uh, are you thinking about me I'm like boy we only have met like three times in my life I, I have known you and I've known you for now maybe two and a half years, three years and he's like, yeah, are you thinking about me? I'm like, boy, I'm thinking about something else than you so don't be, how you call it, like wanting the the attention from me or like forcing me to think about you because love you don't force and that's not the way to get a lady or a woman's attention and I'm like, dude, this is weird and I don't care what you think, I don't care if you want to think about me, yeah, can I think about you? I said, look, if you want to think about me, fine, but don't say it because every time you say you think about me, it's getting boring and I'm not interested. And then he's like, yeah, I'm sorry. I'm like, sorry doesn't cut it, really. Wow, I'm actually doing like a little tea time. Spilling the tea? Tea time? It's a little thing. It happened when I'm inside and I don't see boys. It's actually quite annoying when they are... How do you say that? In Dutch we say one hopig. See, my English isn't 100%, but I know what I mean. He just sent me. Yeah, I promise you to not like irritate you because I am actually getting bored and I'm like, boy, am I here only to like fill your time by talking to me? I am more than, I'm worth more than that fucking bored time. Oh my god, he just sent me again? No, absolutely not. I just think a lot about you. If I um, get bored, then I just want to send a lot of things to you. I'm like, what did I just say like begin this week, last week, the week before to stop saying that you think about me? Kink. Oh, that's so cringe. Why? I don't like that. Disgusting! Wow. And now he sent me like this. Your picture on Instagram looks again so beautiful that I have to think about you again. What should I do? Should I block him? <laughs> it's getting irritating. Well, I'm getting attention from the wrong boys. I not like it. Me not like it at all. Help me now. Guys, what are you doing? My brother is still working. He's already home. He has to leave like 6 in the morning and works until 2 or 3. 
p.m. Well, it's 4.30 p.m. Oh yeah, what I can do also is read a book. But all my books are fantasy. And they are all in my cupboard. And they are, it's so far. Or I can study a language, like Korean or German. Or my mom's language, Filipino, Tagalog. Is this the life of being quarantined? Normally I'm an introvert. Normally I would love this. But because of my first sales and marketing job, I have become an introvert. And an extrovert. How you call that? An ambivert? I want to go out and use my longboard. It's been a while. My beautiful longboard. I have fallen in half an hour. Like last year. In half an hour. Three times. And I scuffed my knee. It didn't look good. Guys. Help me. I am bored. Oh yeah, I have been making a lot of food. Pasta. To gain some weight. But if you look my arms, where's my food? It all went away. I miss my friends. I don't like it at all. Well, next week, what video will I do? I don't know. I was thinking, like, the, the first thing I wanted to do is, like, help you guys with planning an actual vacation. How I do it step by step. And I will help you with, uh, with uh, planning the vacation. So it's easier for you uh, instead of going to a travel agency and ask, like, Hey, I want to go on vacation. Can you make it for me? Well, that's actually quite expensive. I have a little experience, a little, maybe like 20%. But I'm I'm learning every day and maybe the next video will be about self-love and like accepting who you are and just how you say that because I have been through a rough period of time in my life like when I was 20 years old I was in in um, college then at that time I was in college and then I had like a really rough time when that happened I was like in like a difficult time mental emotional and physical really bad and i had to pick myself back up and start to love myself again love my body love the way i look the love the way i am skinny me and love the way i i dress myself but that's for um the next video because i will briefly talk about how oh my phone says uh you have to take an afternoon snack <laughs> um yeah so always be positive about you you are unique you are special and you are loved always and that's how i got stronger and because all the people around me support me just the way i am that's a story for next week in two weeks I don't know. I don't know when I'm going to post that, but yeah, then uh, you will see that video. But for now, I'm gonna leave you guys and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys!